Every ship is unique. Even sister ships differ from one another, but the aircraft carrier that we'll discuss today has exceeded many in terms of her uniqueness. Shipbuilders laid her down as a battleship, but then changed their mind. However, the ship inherited the armor, secondary armament, and poor maneuverability. Externally, aircraft carrier Kaga resembles Tatlin's tower, intricate bulkheads, the typical Japanese funnel, microscopic superstructures. Everything is tailored for one purpose to launch aircraft. In World of Warships, Kaga appears at Tier 7. As compared to other ships of her tier, Kaga is really huge. This is the first reason for her strengths and weaknesses. On the one hand, she is as visible as Tokyo's skyscrapers. On the other hand, her huge size allows her to carry 85 aircraft. With a hangar like this, you don't need to be frugal when using squadrons. The battleship armor will help Kaga survive longer, but low maneuverability and a turning circle radius of over a kilometer may well reduce your time in battle. At the same time, Kaga boasts the best torpedo protection for her tier. Though the secondary armament has a caliber of 200 millimeters, its firing range is short and it fires AP shells. But secondary armament isn't what makes a carrier cool, my friend. And it's not the armor that gave Kaga the proud attack carrier type. Of course, airplanes are key assets for a carrier. And in this aspect, the Japanese ship is truly unique. But first things first. While Kaga's fighter squadrons are pretty similar to those of other Japanese carriers, no other ship in the game has bombers and torpedo bombers like this. The first thing that catches your eye is that a squadron has six airplanes, an unusual strength for a Japanese carrier. The further we go, the more interesting it gets. Her bombers are incredibly accurate. For manual release, the bomb site is not much larger than Yamato's turret. This is what I call precision bombing. Fans of massive explosions can now put all their bombs into the target. Of course, some skill is required to use this top-notch tool effectively. The key to success here is practice. And finally, besides being the only Japanese ship that can launch two squadrons of six torpedo bombers, for the first time in World of Warships, a squadron attacks in two lines, each having three aircraft. The first line features a wider torpedo spread, and the second echelon has a narrower one. At first, it takes some getting used to, but then it's nothing but joy. Dodging this torpedo attack is not an easy thing to do. In addition, you have two flight control variants, strike and versatile. So you can choose what you like best extremely accurate bombers or splendid torpedo bombers. Fans of both aircraft types will have a lot of fun. Judging by what we've said above, Kaga should be able to wipe out anyone in her way and win even the most difficult battle on her own. But this only looks easy. Kaga had to pay a high price for the unique characteristics of her aircraft. All of them are Tier 6 planes. This means fewer hit points, less damage caused, and lower speed. A serious challenge. Fighting against enemies of higher tiers will be very interesting and difficult. Therefore, every commander's skill point should be spent wisely depending on your battle tactics. This is when Kaga will reveal all her strengths. Indeed, she isn't the easiest ship to play, but those who aren't afraid of experimenting and trying different playstyles will be rewarded. Kaga can bring you not only increased income and faster commander training, but also unmatched pleasure. Find your own way, captains, and good luck in everything.